Happy Teacher Tuesday! If unfamiliar, my name's Miss Bree, an early childhood education teacher. Make sure to subscribe by clicking the red button under the screen and clicking on the notification bell to get reminders when new videos are uploaded. Now let's see what's on our schedule for today. Meow! <laughs> today we will be doing cat themed activities. The other day, I met Grumpy Cat at Mall of America. Boy, was his face grumpy. Grumpy. Even his owner looked grumpy. So I thought it would be fun to do cat-themed activities. For our first activity, we will be doing... Cat lacing, fun! And that's how you make and play cat lacing. Meow! For our second activity, we will be making... Cat witches, yum! That's how you make cat witches. Meow! Mm. What a perfect snack! Let's get started! Meow 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 For cat lacing you will need a small cardboard square, ribbon, pipe cleaners, scissors, hole punch, and a marker. First, you will draw or trace a cat outline on the cardboard with a marker. An adult will cut out the cat image. End hole punch around the entire cat outline. Like this, meow. Now hole punch four close holes where the whiskers would go. And cut two two inch pipe cleaners and weave them in to the four whisker holes. Optional, decorate the cat, like gluing on some googly eyes, coloring it, drawing on a nose and mouth. Next, you will need a string or ribbon that is three feet long. I can jump rope with it! <laughs> and with one end of the string, tie a double knot around the bottom of the cat. Now it's time to lace, weaving in and out to all the dots. And that's how you make and play cat lacing. Meow! To play it again, you can unweave it and start all over. Are you ready to play again? For cat witches, you will need whole grain or wheat bread, sun butter, and sliced fruit like blueberries, strawberries, and bananas. This healthy snack can be made in three simple steps. First, an adult will cut out the cat's face using a knife like this. Second, spread on sun butter or Nutella if there's no nut allergies. And add delicious fruit. Meow! Third, eat and enjoy this perfect snack. And that's how you make cat witches. Meow. Mm. 
It was actually a really fun experience meeting Grumpy Cat at Mall of America. His owner was so nice. She let me share these photos on YouTube. And Grumpy Cat was smaller than I thought he was going to be. He wasn't your average size cat. He was actually really small. He was so cute. Here are some photos where we are smiling. Well, thank you so much for watching. Make sure to subscribe, and I will see you next time on Teacher Tuesday. Meow!